During his national address, Prime Minister Mitchell alluded to a year which would test the mettle of the leadership and the people as a whole. He notes the fact that the NDC administration has set ambitious targets in the first of its five years in office. Prime Minister Deacon Mitchell entered into the new year with optimism that the path to sustainable development would require a collaborative approach from all parties. We are also mindful that 60 months or five years may seem like a long time. But in the scope of governance, it can go by very quickly. As we embark on this journey of transformation and positive change, our success as a country and as a people requires us to also transform our thinking, to move Grenada forward at the pace that we would like. We need every Grenadian at home and abroad to be a part of our nation's progress. The Prime Minister reiterated the importance of transformation, which has been the government's watchwords. His plea for cooperation comes amid times when global economic changes are having a significant impact on the cost of living locally. The threat of climate change on its own and the very real and existential effects that sea level rise holds for the future of our island state is enough to help us realize that we need to band together as a nation and also as a region. The negative fallout from the war in Ukraine on the heels of a devastating global pandemic continues to adversely affect global supply chains and increase the cost of food and fuel and worsen an already high cost of living. In light of all of the above, no one is coming to save us. We must save ourselves. Prime Minister Mitchell beckoned to all Grenadians to embrace the opportunities to grow that will present themselves in 2023 as they will contribute towards economic and social advancement of the country. For GBN News, Beverly Tellisford.